Thanks again, Geralt. I'll take it from here. And I'll be sure to tell Roach and Dijkstra how you sliced up those dim-witted cocksuckers. As I see it, they'll be so impressed they'll shit themselves. So what'll you do now? What do you mean? Head back to Novigrad. Dijkstra, Roach and I have got a master plan to set in motion. I'll ask again. Details. Forgive me, mate. I plow in calm. See, were it just up to me, I'd spill it loud and proud. You're trustworthy like no one else I know. But I'm not on my own. So, blooming unilateral decisions are out of the question. Trap stays shut, I'm afraid. Right. Gotcha. Tell me, you were a fence in Vizima. How'd you become a cobbler? Pick the least suspicious profession. The fence thing, shite cover. Pissed too many folk off. I didn't need the attention. It's all about being an innkeep. You meet a lot of folk, you know, tossers mostly, but willing to talk about all sorts of things. Problem is, you're tied down like a mutt on a chain. One in the same yard all the time. Whereas a cobbler travels everywhere. Better believe it. <laughs> Even cobble together this fancy rolling stall. Lovely. Bloody bullseye. I've made a small fortune out of it since the war started. Those pricks in uniform are always marching. Know what happens when their cocksucking boots disintegrate? Their feet bleed, blister up. Not a soldier out there wouldn't sell his mother for a comfy pair of combat boots. So long, Taller. And good luck. Oh, I can bloody use it. Radovid's one crafty oar with a clap. But we'll figure a way round that twat. Soon the old bloody North will be blathering about how he got fucked. Careful it's not also blathering about three assassins, drawn and quartered. <laughs> Fear not, Geralt. We know what we're doing. Farewell. <laughs>